what's up guys? This is Jay Hopfinger. Yo, Johnny Merrill here at Mount Baker. What up? I'm Dylan Siggers. How's it going? My name's LJ Strenio, and we're talking about one of my new favorite skis, the Lion Vision. Man, I love the Vision because I can take it anywhere and do anything. It's a lightweight, very powerful backcountry ski with a really low entry for someone who's not as comfortable to someone like us who you know, want to charge lines and hit big backcountry jumps. Uh, this ski has been my go-to all season long. Powder, touring, hitting big cliffs. A ski is just super versatile. You can use it for so many different things. I know people that'll ride them just for touring. I know people that ride them as their everyday hill ski. I know people that go nuts doing stunts on them and doing tricks. I feel like anyone can grab these skis and have fun on them. But the rare part is that it also can do anything. Uh, I'm a pretty heavy guy and I ski pretty aggressively and I can still just have as much fun on the ski as my dad. We ski the exact same ski. There's three different sizes depending on, you know, the style of skier you are. We have the 98, a little thinner, uh, incredibly lightweight. The 98, super fun inbound ski or lightweight touring ski. We're skiing inbounds, maybe hitting some jumps, going through the woods, mixing it up a bit. The 108 is really kind of the, uh, the daily driver for most folk. It's got perfect width for ski and pow. It also rips on the groomers. The Vision 108 is a nice middle ground if you're someone who wants a one ski quiver. The Vision 108, this thing weighs nothing. I just picked it up and I'm already surprised on how little it weighs. It's super versatile, it's light, um, and it just skis the whole mountain really well. You know, you're touring in the back country and you still want to go in bounds or hit jumps here and there, the 108 is like your perfect happy medium. And then for the guys that are, you know, in deeper snow and skiing something a little heavier, we have the 118, which uh, there's really no upward limit on that ski. Vision 118, that's the go-to for me. Film days in the backcountry or skiing on the resort, um, that thing kind of does it all for me. So this is my favorite ski that I've ever had. It's a super stable, fun, playful stomp stick of a ski. This guy's got just enough twin tip that I can go backwards on it, land switch and pow, ski through crap and pow, switch, and uh, that's great, but it's still a flat enough tail that you have all the power you need when you take big landings and you're kind of in the back seat, even though you don't want to be. I was uh, kings and queens at Corbett's this year, Jacksonville, Wyoming. Um, I ended up doing a double flat spin into it. I uh, walked away at third place, so I'm pretty stoked. Yeah, the, the vision was the weapon of choice on that thing. So the visions are made with THC, triple hybrid construction. It's a composite material of carbon, arabid, and fiberglass. And what it does is allow you to have a nice, smooth, dampened ride, but an incredibly lightweight ski at the same time. For how light the ski is, I'm impressed every time with how well it holds up and chunder and big landings. It's got camber underfoot, early rise in the tip and tail. It's a sweet spot of being stiff, but not being too stiff that you can't do stunts. It's dope, it's all black, it's not ugly. Uh, the bases are cool, they say line on it super big, which is dope when you're a big line fan like I am. It's incredibly lightweight and snappy, and it allows me to go into the backcountry where I haven't spent as much time. It's very user friendly, and I can still find myself ripping turns like some of these backcountry guys. Makes you feel like you are a big mountain guy. Vision Series kicks ass, and it's kind of helped me be able to do everything I want to do on my skis and not feel held back by traditional ski design. And I just feel really at home whenever I'm riding the ski.